My knee's acting up again, and you know what helps? Rubbing the darn thing with hot pepper. Trouble is, my supplies run dry. If you got one to spare, I'd be much obliged. I gotta help out this old b and his f knees. I don't got any peppers, bro. I'm sorry. No peppers. Why not just make the old man on his knees? What the hell do you mean by that? <laughs> well, his knee- wait, his knees are sore. I'm pretty sure George is the one in the wheelchair, right? How the f*** are his knees sore? He just sits in a chair all day. I think he's faking. I don't think he needs that wheelchair. We got an imposter. Why would his knees be sore if he doesn't use them? That's what I'm saying. Like, something's up. Look at this. We go in his house. Look! He just wants pepper for his food. Maybe it's one of those things where he only uses the wheelchair sometimes. I've never seen him leave his wheelchair. That's all I'm saying. I'm not saying that, you know, he's fraudulent, but he might be. Look at that. We are a couple floors away from the bottom. God damn. I just got here and I'm already fighting for my life. What? What is this thing? I don't even know what the f this thing is. Look like a black Pikmin. Hey, cherry's low key a sus ass fruit right next to bananas if you eating cherries by the pear that's low-key kind of sus you damn near putting balls in your mouth if you eat like a cherry one by one you know that makes a little bit more sense you know less suspicious but if you eating cherry and pears you know you might as well just put some balls in your mouth put some balls in your jaws i got all the females and the dudes in stardew and then i get to this floor that looks like balls in a shaft finally jesus <laughs> That took forever to find that last one. Yes, sir. You found the skull key. All right, there you go. We finished the mines. We have done it. Isn't Abigail the girl who sells bombs when you marry her? That gives me all the more reason to marry her. You just sold it for me. Oh, I forgot about this. Hey, offset. <laughs> v goes. <laughs> I walk up to her. I said, turn that shit off. Casimir, why are you out here in the rain? Just doing some work, enjoying the weather. I could ask you the same question. Come on, I'm enjoying the weather. I love rain. Yeah, I guess you would be one to appreciate this somber ambience. It's my favorite weather. I came here to spend some time alone. Yeah, Casimir, why you bother? <laughs> but I don't mind your company. We're in there, boys. We're in there. I will get bitches. You're getting soaked. Come stand under the tree. Abigail, there's no tree here. I cut this tree down. Abigail. <laughs> Abigail, there's no tree here. Abigail, I'm getting soaked. Oh, shit. A mini harp. <laughs> when the fuck did Casimir get a mini harp? You're full of surprises, Casimir. I'm impressed. I'm impressed too. Where the hell did he pull that out of? Oh shit, we about to do it. Hey, hey, hey. This shit about to go hard on the radio. Wait until TikTok gets a hold of the dubstep remix version of this shit. So gamers, since you're such a ladies man, how can I make a girl phone in love with me? Obviously, if you want to get a girl to like you, go up to her, you tell her, I watch Game Raiders. If that doesn't make her fall in love or question who Game Raiders is, direct her to my channel, all right? That's where you do that first. That's about it. That's really all I can give you. If that doesn't make her fall in love right there, then I don't, I don't know. She's not the one for you. If she ain't into Game Raiders, then I don't want her. Yeah, if you can't watch Game Raiders. What the fuck is up with people talking shit about my blueberries in this town? I hate this town. Everyone I've talked to that is eating my blueberries have called them dog shit, dude. I'm tired of being disrespected <laughs> about my damn blueberries. Oh shit, look at Casimir. Casimir about to hop in the tub. Any females in here? Yeah, I'm tired of everyone in this town sneak dissing my fucking blueberries. They're not even sneak dissing. They're telling me to my face that my blueberries are shit. Pierre told me. The homeless dude told me. Like, what the fuck? Just don't eat the blueberries, bro. Why is Pierre still selling them? Talking mad shit about my blueberries. I, I swear to God. I'm tired of it. I still made money for those blueberries, though. Pierre still gave me like 10 racks for those blueberries, though. So who's the winner? Fucking exactly. More blueberries to sell so that the whole town will talk shit about me every day. Cold take, Pierre's a bitch. That's not even a cold take. I hate Pierre. That's why I'm stealing Pierre's daughter and I'm a... Never mind. That's too graphic. <laughs> That's too graphic. Gives you money for your garbage blueberries and now say you're gonna do mischievous things to his daughter bro if he wants his fucking shop to make any money he better be giving me money for my blueberries he says my blueberries are shit and he sells it to everybody like he's the one he's the one being a fucking fiend about it he said ah these blueberries taste like shit anyways 5.99 how many do you want 10 of them it's like bro if they taste like shit don't sell them to anyone but he's like i gotta make a uh, i gotta make a pretty penny he's like fucking asshole if they taste bad throw them out dickhead <laughs> The purple haired girl's also a bitch. Don't you call my my wife, soon to be wife, a bitch? I heard that she makes bombs, okay? So don't you ever talk shit about my wife. <laughs> 
Demetrius, my boy. Hey, ain't it low key kind of racist? They want me to give the the melon to the black dude. Hold up, Stardew. Hold up. This is perfect. It's just what I need for my research. It's gonna be hard not to eat it. Th hold up, Stardew. Hold up. Nah, I don't know now, Stardew. You you had to make him say it. This is gonna be hard not to eat. Stardew Valley racist mod. All right, Pierre. I'm selling you six. Look at the money. The shit is shaking with how much money I was getting. Thirty six. 999 nine, nine. what a great number spoiler alert isn't abigail i saw this on a video i think isn't abigail the wizard's daughter spoiler alert for my stardew noobs but i know we got veterans in here abigail's the wizard's daughter isn't she yeah her mom cheated with the wizard damn yeah fuck pierre i'm glad that his wife cheated on him that's exactly what pierre deserves see me and pierre were homies me and Pierre were homies, man. Until he fucking shamed my goddamn blueberries. All right, I'm about to show you guys the hardest mini game, Ju Junimo Kart. Bro, I tried playing this shit. I cannot get past the first level. And I don't know if it's just because I suck. I'm not experienced with it, but this shit hard as hell. <laughs> you see what I mean? The levels are randomly generated. Bro, how, how hard do they want me to hit the space bar? <laughs> what do you get for beating this? We got any uh, experienced Stardew players? Oh, yeah. <gasps> oh, my God. I made that somehow. Ah! I finally got a checkpoint. You saw how much I did just to get a checkpoint? Oh, my God. My space bar got stuck. No. <laughs> Bro, I was still so far away from the end. I'm not playing anymore, Junie Mook. <laughs> Is this another person about to talk shit about my blueberries? I swear to God. I swear to God. I know I have a lot of non-gold star and silver star blueberries. But I still sold more than just the garbage ones. So the other day, I bought a fresh blueberry at Pierre. It was perfect on a bed of greens and a dash of my special vinaigrette. Oh, thank God. She said it was perfect. Thank the Lord. See, I thought she was about to start talking shit about my blueberries. I swear to God, I was about to be furious. <laughs> Everyone I talk to always talk shit about my blueberries, all right? I'm more than just a blueberry farmer. I have a heart. Hey, I'm dressed up like a blueberry on stream right now. Look at the, look at the hoodie I'm wearing. I'm dressed, I'm dressed up like a blueberry. <laughs> Should do a challenge where if you die, you have to eat a raw potato. What am I, Doug Doug? He said, bro, I got so much ass hair that my diarrhea comes out as filtered drinking water. Gotta be like top five most interesting things I've heard. Damn, that boy Casimir. That boy said drip drop. That boy got style. Oh, Casimir, this is embarrassing. I threw one of your corns you sold us into my compost bin. Now the whole thing smells horrendous. Where did you find that? I'm tired of this town talking shit about my goddamn plants. Where's your daughter at? I'm taking your daughter from you guys. Where the hell is uh, Abigail at, bro? Standing in front of the wizard tower? She's blowing things up. <laughs> She's standing in front of the wizard tower. Like, even she knows that that's her real father, bro. I'm about to have Abigail make a bomb and leave it in Pierre's store. <laughs> Do you guys remember when I... <laughs> Do you guys remember when I sabotaged the soup when the mayor came over? Good times. I bought the tastiest corn from Pierre's shop the other day. He said that he grew the... I swear to God, Pierre. I swear to fucking God, Pierre. I said I wasn't going to say it earlier. Pierre, I'm taking your fake daughter and I'm going to rearrange her guts. See, I didn't want to say that earlier. I thought it was too vulgar to say. But now Pierre has started a fucking... He started a war. I seriously love this, Casimir. You're the best. Yeah, I know. I know. Don't worry, Abigail. I will I will take you from your parents and get you out of that home that I know she hates. You know what? I'm going to the JoJo Mart to buy shit now. I'm going to the JoJo Mart to buy stuff. Pierre has done it. He's really pissed me the fuck off. The only thing I'm doing in Pierre's house is just trying to get his fucking daughter. It's not even his daughter either. Oh shit, Abigail's birthday is this month. 
fifth year season. There you go. We're almost there, boys. We're almost there. Slowly but surely. Her birthday's coming up. That's like a guaranteed, you know? How many hearts is she at? So it might be six soon. So we might see her uh, next event soon. Make sure we got some uh, gold star, some grade A stuff. You know what I'm saying? And nobody will make fun of my crops quality ever again and if somebody does make fun of my crops again you know man they may not be in this town for too much longer that's all i'm gonna say okay they might not get to live in the town of pelican whatever the fuck's called for too much longer okay i may, may have done something really stupid here uh i don't have a pickaxe <laughs> we'll figure it out tomorrow it's fine oh broke his ankles he didn't see that shit coming <laughs> 